express my gratitude for trusting the lowly pyromancer and allowing me to gaze upon this majestic flame. As promised, I will impart pyromancies to you. But first, you will need a flame of your own. Careful you don't burn yourself with it. <laughs> To learn pyromancies, you must vow to become my pupil. I know, I know, but such is the way of the world. Respect your elders and so on. And pyromancy, of course, is no exception. <laughs> Do not be gone for long. What is a teacher without a pupil? <laughs> Benheim, here to teach you sorceries. Let us begin with the basics. The ideal sorcerer bears the twin faces of the dragon. Oh, you could at least act as if you're paying attention. I don't mean to seem overbearing, but have you forgotten? In exchange for my sorceries, you are to bring me knowledge in the form of scrolls detailing the secrets of sorcery. I hope you're not one to break a promise. Come again. I was a nun. I would be pleased to share the tales of miracles with you. Although, to be honest, I only know a few. But if I had a divine tome, I could tell you many tales and more. Oh, only I cannot see. Terribly sorry, but you'll have to find me a divine tome in Braille. Have a pleasant journey, Champion of Ash. I pray for your safety. <laughs> 